What I want to say about um, Islamic bioethics in South Africa is that uh, the only organization that is involved in promoting Islamic bioethics in the whole of South Africa is the Islamic Medical Association of South Africa. From the very f beginning of its inception in 1980, or establishment of the Islamic Medical Association of South Africa, there was a commitment by the Muslim medical doctors to concentrate on research and uh, publication in the field of uh, the medicine of science and uh, Tibur Nabawi and so on and all the other uh, I mean in all the other strata of what is normally included in the field of Islamic bioethics. Now we have been doing that. We have brought over, uh, brought about a whole lot of uh, publications, you know, starting from, you know, how the uh, physician should should also uh, should treat the patient, and uh, going right through in Ramadan also the diet that uh, Muslims should actually um, be uh, taking in the month of Ramadan, which will help them and so on. So this, this is what we have done. And then the latest and uh, the biggest contribution is that the Muslim doctors in South Africa believe that, medic, that uh, medicine is a human right. And from the beginning, we had established clinics to serve the African population, the majority Africans. And now, alhamdulillah, this year, we're going to open the first Islamic hospital by the name of Dr. Ahmed Al Qadi Hospital, and that will cater for both Muslims and non-Muslims people who have the means to be uh, taken care of in this hospital, or the people who would, will not be having the means. Then we will provide the finance for that.